What's up, everybody? Crypto Muscle coming to you in a YouTube video. Here we are in Ashford now, worldwide. Think it is where it's at. Crypto Muscle and the Crypto Muscle Network coming to you in a video. All right, another Monday. It goes by, and we just fly. And Burst Take is flying off the handle. All right, it is flying off the handle. This thing is booming. All right, and going strong. All right. Uh, this rendition of it is a whole lot better than the previous rendition of it. And I'm glad that they decided to shift gears in this direction. And I think people are seeing and experiencing the results of such with being in burst stake and this sort of rendition of it, which is a whole lot better than the previous one. So uh, it was great that they did all that. And we are experiencing uh the great results that are coming out of that you know so cool all right good stuff here and uh to me it's worthwhile to continue to talk about this as i've been doing on mondays and thursdays you know um because in a sense it's kind of like a mid-level but yet it's kind of like fast money as well and uh the opportunity in this thing is to me great <laughs> i mean look at the returns you get three four or five percent all right, and these lock-in periods, it's just the terms of the cycle of the platform that, or, or the plan that you're in. Great plan, right? Great results. And it's all about your commitment to it. Are you committed to 14 days? Are you committed to 21 days? Are you committed to 30 days? Right, it's up to you on how much of a commitment you want to put into it. And how it works, you just go in, you top up your wallet with your desired crypto, as they say, Whichever crypto you want to grow, stake it, right? Because you're staking it in this platform. And then you pull the rewards from it, as I've been doing every Monday and Thursday so far. So they have impressive returns, yes. I'm I'm impressed. <laughs> they have unmatched security. I mean, yeah, they do have 2FA and all that. And so far, it's been holding up very well. All right. Uh, everything is looking pretty good. They have community education. Yes, they do have a Telegram community. And, you know, the people in it are pretty good and people are uh, raise questions, it gets answered, you know. So let's talk about statistics now. So we're looking at, what, 13 days? Looking pretty damn good around 167,000 and growing. Uh, 32,000 paid out, so not bad. It's a good start. And look at this. For, to me, this is a low base, all right? 1,400 people is really not a whole lot when you look at the state, the platform community at large, right? Uh, the potential, the numbers, all right? The, of what can come out of all this and what can come in to all this, the potential is still huge. And you know what? The potential as well can be still growing, still, I don't know, it hasn't even reached its peak yet is what I'm trying, trying to say. So, um, you know, it's something to keep an eye on, but this is not even peak potential yet. So there's still ways to continue to, continue to grow. And it appears that Burst Stake is taking their time with a nice grow, slow grow approach, right? And at the same time, they're still accumulating pretty decent amount of funds to utilize in trading and paying out rewards and still continue to grow. Uh, in all of this, you know, different facets here. So I think Burst Take is better than advertised, all right? And so uh, you should really seriously take a look at this. Uh, let's see, market update. So Bitcoin's at 52,000 right now. It's kind of lingering around this whole uh, 50 to 52,000 mark last few days. Um, let's see what else here. This thing's actually up too. This was like, 11 12 cents a couple days ago now it's 13 cents i mean binance coin shit a month ago i think it was around 250 like a month ago yeah so interesting stuff here i think peak price back then for ripple was like three bucks i remember it was like three dollars ish for ripple back then like 2018 days i was like man i almost bought some too just because um I thought 
the way this thing kept on going up in trajectory, I thought, man, this thing's going to be hot. And then it tanked just like every other crypto in 2019. <laughs> yeah, it went bad. It went down bad, too. Uh, for what Ripple did at that time, you know, being that there, it's kind of like a ledger sort of crypto coin. Um, it, it went down bad. And then it's kind of creeping its way back up. It, you know, it survived the lawsuit and everything of being a security and all that stuff. So, yeah, very interesting. Affiliate program, four levels, all right? Uh, you have a 5%. A two and a half, a one and a half. All right, so when you have all that together, you're looking at a, what, 9%? Is it nine? Uh, let's see, half is eight. Yeah, 9% total. All right, not bad. 9% below what I, I always use 10% as like a baseline. That's just me personally using that as a baseline measure, but it doesn't necessarily mean you know, you, you can use that as a baseline. That's just me. Uh, I feel like 10 is a good median baseline. So um, that's what we got there. The payouts, they pay in a timely manner, right? Got to keep in mind, these are not instant payouts. So when we look at it, uh, let's see here. Withdraw, no, not fees. You know, it takes up to 48 hours. So anywhere between now and 48 hours, it could be fast, it could be slow, depending on the day. Uh, today, oh, by the way, today's President's Day. So those of you that are celebrating presidents, <laughs> today is President's Day. All right. Um, that's where it's at. So, um, yeah, good stuff here. Oh, and by the way, they do have, this is, the preferred plans to me uh, flexible their lower daily rates and they do have bigger minimums but there's also unstake fee of 20 percent but why would you want that you know what I mean might as well just these are not long periods of time might as well just jump into these get a bigger rate of return and then once your terms are complete you get your deposit back anyways I mean, this is, like, once you go to this, all right, 21 days, it's like, you know, you have, like, these 20% fees, right? 20% fees, when you look at it, it's going to take you at least 20 days for this one. This one's going to take you 10 days, right, for a 20% fee to be covered. This one's going to take you a week. So what's the point, all right, of staying in for a week or 10 days or 20 days when you look at it, 14 days, 21, and 30. You might as well just go into these. I mean, that's a no-brainer to me. Um, but, hey, to each its own, right? I'm just trying to show you guys, you know, like, hey, I mean, common sense, right? But sometimes, you know, like in my profession, they always say common sense ain't so common, right? So, but, you know, it's, I just got to show you guys. Uh, I've been sitting on this Bitcoin amount. It's a small amount, and it's not enough for a minimum, so I just got to wait. But I do have a 246 withdrawal there, so 246.56. And then put in the 2FA. Burr steak. Burr steak. And just like that. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. All right, so it'll be within 48 hours. So good stuff. But yeah, it's a great platform, though, all right? And I know, I know sometimes people, you know, may say some things like, oh, you know, this is just like this other one and blah, blah, blah. But it's like, well, you don't really... You know, gauge off of that. I mean, if you look at past performances, all I got to say is they were great past performances. So, Burr Stake, to me, is going to be right up to par with all that, all right, when it comes to past performance. So, past performance is indicative of future results, right? 
That's what they always say. Well, I say I'm saying the opposite, but but um, I don't know. I don't like that statement though. But it rings true for certain people and certain individuals, right? When you really think about it, like uh, when it comes to like the Tiwis of the world, right? You know, when you say past results isn't indicative of future results, it is because once he always gets wrecked and always continues to get wrecked, right? So that's easily past performance. Uh, how about Marco's ass bag? Same thing. Um, past performance is indicative of future results because every time he bullshits and bullshits and bullshits and BSs about platforms, he'll swerve and go in a different direction. And two things will happen. One, he's going to completely ignore it and hide like a bitch. And two, he'll um, try to deflect that, oh, I didn't say that, and oh, no, 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 you know, like, he'll backtrack and deflect, when he's like, no, 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 you did say that, stupid ass, and so, uh, when you call him out on it, he'll just deflect or avoid, and hide like a bitch, so, those are examples, all right, but the example I bring is, shit, the reality in real, in crypto, all right, I do live withdrawals, I uh, tell it like it is. I don't need a bullshit. Why do I need a bullshit for? I tell you guys everything that comes out every time. When there's always platform news, I tell you guys what happens every time. I, I don't get it. Uh, and But you want to listen to those bullshit YouTubers that lie, blatantly in your face. <laughs> they lied in your face. And you still want to follow them and listen to them when they straight up lie in your face? right blatantly in your face and i tell it like it is but yet you know people don't want to hear the reality they don't want to hear the truth about everything well shit <laughs> all right then you're going to get what's coming to you then all right so uh i'm just saying you know that's just what it is in crypto but yeah so birth stake is a good opportunity though all right you don't want to miss out on this opportunity it's worthwhile they're they're on the up and up and it's staking for everyone, right? Great returns. And they're taking a nice, steady, almost a, a slow growth uh, process to this thing that in time, it's just going to continue to just snowball and get bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. You're going to be like, damn, I wish I got in earlier is what you're going to be saying. But I do like how you have the opportunity to grow that crypto, right? And uh, this is one of those places to grow that crypto. So it's something you shouldn't miss out on, all right? It's a great platform, like I said. And, um, you know, it, it's really hard to uh, look at platforms and really like, oh, I feel really good about it. So I feel pretty good about Burstake. I, I would say that I feel better about it now than I did when I first got into it, because when I first got into it, I was like, okay, I mean, we'll see how, how far this thing can go, you know, um, and just kind of went with that, right? Here, now, in a sense, it's like version two, I feel like way better confidence in it, that it's like, wow, this is actually a really good platform, and it's because of the the returns are a whole lot better. It's, it's more worthwhile to come back to and check on and follow up with and to share with you know so that's why i that's what i like about burst stake so um again something to check out grow that crypto is very easy i don't think i even walked through the steps of depositing yet so let's do that real quick so you want to go to your wallet all right top up whatever crypto you want to use so bitcoin litecoin ETH, dash ripple doge tether 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 tron or bnb so once you choose the crypto you want to grow, right? Once you do that, put in the amount. There's these, there's also a top-up guide. All right, the minimums. And once you figure that out, hit top up, follow directions, and you're in. So after you're in, it's going to show a balance. So what you got to do is you got to stake it now. Pick the plan. These are the better ones, not the flexible. There you go. Comment down below. Links down below. I'll see you next one.